My name is Jacob Cook. I'm a project director and free software consultant at Savo Fan Linux in Montreal. I work in the digital innovation web and mobility department, which works with clients across a wide range of platforms, including Django, Drupal, Node.js, Android, iOS, Docker, and others. As a project director, I work in concert with our clients and help them assemble game plans for how we can best address the technical challenges and business needs that they face. And as a free software consultant, I get to work with our other talented engineers to implement these plans through software developments, all the while using the power and flexibility that free and open source software solutions can bring. We often work with clients that have very specific needs regarding the development, deployment, and performance of the applications that they use. Many of these challenges can be addressed by improving the pipeline of developments through either implementing continuous integration, continuous delivery, containerization, or other strategies can pay huge dividends when it comes to getting a quality project to market on time and on budget. So for example, we've worked with clients that have some well-established web projects built using Django and have a defined deployment mechanism like using fast Fabric or even old-fashioned FTP, but they'll often be unable to catch serious bugs before they enter production or struggle to quickly and dependably push new features to market. A continuous delivery pipeline powered by solutions like Docker and Jenkins can work wonders for this kind of problem. Docker allows us to create an isolated environment for the execution of our application inside a container. This container is a distributable artifact that can be tested and deployed to any sort of environment in an idempotent and reliable way. And this way you can easily set up in a development environment that can perfectly match what you see in production. Combined with other Jen tools like Jenkins or GitLab CI or Travis, uh, we can build a pipeline that installs the application inside these containers, tests them, and the isolated environment can be used to be deployed directly to production with very little to no downtime at all or any manual configurations to worry about. Other ways in which Docker and Jenkins can help is by dramatically increasing the ease with which applications can be scaled up to meet demand. Using technologies like Docker Stack with Docker Swarm or Kubernetes, we can deploy individual components of these applications in a decentralized way uh, for load balancing scenarios and the like. And using these kinds of components, we don't have to worry about networking between them because Docker will handle that seamlessly for us. Uh, using these kinds of tools has really transformed the way that I work on my personal projects. Uh, I can't set up any kind of project, even if it's a small project these days, without having a dependable pipeline like this put in place. And it just really eliminates a lot of the potential bottlenecks and slowdowns that can crop up uh, over the course of a project. And I can't imagine my job today without them. Mm -hmm.